Well, hello there from another lovely day in Liverpool. We've got not the greatest of weather today. Perfect weather all throughout the whole month of uh, August and even, gosh, that hot freaking day. Uh, but we got a little bit of rain today. But Liverpool has loads of churches and cathedrals. They have one that's bombed out, supposedly, right down the road from us on the old Bold Street. They've also got two cathedrals. One of them looks very sinister, I I've seen from a distance. And also they've got a beautiful park, Sefton Park. I'm done explaining. Why don't we just go out and explore this lovely little city? It's not that little. It's actually quite big. Let's go. Everyone tell Bliss she looks really pretty today. Especially Bliss. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see what's in the hippie hole first before we go to church. It looks pretty, pretty funky. <laughs> There's a very, very funky bucket hat. All right. <laughs> cool. The cool thing about Bold Street is that they've got loads of these weird independent shops. <laughs> we, where are we? <laughs> they've got an American pizza slice though. Same place we went to the other day. Really nice. And here is the bombed out church. Does not look too bombed out, but I assure you on the inside it is. You are enough. Keep going. Hashtag mental health. <laughs> hashtag mental My favorite hashtag. <laughs> that's from Jesus himself, actually. Okay, well, that's not working. Uh, turns out the bombed out church is also closed out today. Uh, maybe we'll be back a bit later, but no dice. Jesus is uh, not there right now. We have to wait till he's back home. Got some coffee at the Hope Street. Moving on to find these... Oh, there it is. This is the street. Uh, there's there's the big evil-looking lair of a church. Uh, and on this side? No. No no other church yet, but there's there's that one. There's the other cathedral. And there's the other one. Which one do we go to first? That one. All right, let's do it. What do we got here? Just look. A case history. I mean, that looks pretty cool. Interesting little culture here. Can you find Sir Paul McCartney and Clock? Qu I just passed Clock Fong. Did you? I did. I passed him. Um, oh, cool. So those are all their cases for performing arts. Really important. Really glad they have this right outside of school, and they can't spell comedian correctly. Well, that's silly. It's just so. The na who's the naked man? Well, you said it was Jesus yesterday. That's not Jesus. <laughs> they, yeah, they put a little sensor box over whoever that is. That looks like... What, is, what a Chad. Wow. This place is massive. Oh, wait. This church has neon lights? I felt you, Lord. I know you loved me. I felt you, and I know you loved me. That sounds like a good song. I just, I've never seen neon lights in a cathedral. Even a church needs antivirus protection, but theirs has expired. Tragic. <laughs> All right, so where are people from? Definitely a lot of people from the UK. That's pretty cool. And literally no one from the US has come to this church in Liverpool. Wow. Can't, well, that's kind of wild. Come on, Bliss, just put it in New Jersey. No, please. Bliss, please. this is your geography test. <laughs> well, I just want to say it's funny. I know somewhere around here. Yeah, that's correct. I know it's somewhere in this area. Mm hmm mm hmm There. You're joking, right? Only because, you know, I'd say I'd go to the beach all the time, right? Okay, um, here. <laughs> all right, so that's Virginia. Yeah, yeah, here, here, yeah. <laughs> that's pretty cool. <laughs> oh, yeah, I love fonts. A little bit of milk, lemon milk. <laughs> Hope you all have a good day. Have you seen these books? They're my favorite um, biblical books. We've got Where is God in a Coronavirus World? Oh my God. And Looking Beyond Brexit. Very relevant. So what were your thoughts on the Liverpool Cathedral? Um, a little spooky. A little spooky. It was really big. But beautiful. Big. I always just think when I see like giant cathedrals, like what, I guess, what, what would the purpose be of having it so large, but there's multiple places to have mass, to, to give, to the poor, hopefully. Uh, I think this one, we're now at the Metropolitan, right? This one's quite insanely large as well. Not as big as the other one, but this one just looks like um, like an evil layer in a way. Uh, quite interesting about this one. Uh, I don't think you'll see this anywhere on a map, but hey, look over here, right next to the Liverpool Science Park. That's, that's funny. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I keep walking in front of your shot. <laughs> <laughs> kind of looks like where the UN would meet, like, What's with these banners? It's like advertising Where's the church. The bells? Where? Oh my god, there's big bells and there's also little tiny crosses up there. We're just so excited to go to church. Donation jar looks just like the church. 
I like that. Wow, look at this place. Whoa. This is also just really, really, really big, but different style. Reminds me of one in Rio de Janeiro. What are your thoughts on this church? Less spooky. <laughs> Does that mean less God? <laughs> <laughs> You've seen my video from Rio. It's just a very similar design church. It's, it's really beautiful. Oh my God, look at the stained glass. It's so nice. Honestly, not as good stained glass, sorry, but... Wow. <laughs> I actually quite enjoy this spot. It looks like um, a modern artist's interpretation of a church. It's just, just one of these. Nice. These figures just look so... I mean, it's intentionally gruesome, but I'm just not used to it. So, interestingly enough, um, this, this one, right, this, this metropolitan church was the Roman Catholic variant, Whereas uh, the big giant one over there was the Church of England. And uh, I kept saying that uh, if you don't know, Church of England is Episcopal in the US. And a lot of that one looked so much like the one I grew up in, except like the one I grew up in was like a tenth of the size. Uh, but I just would have expected the Roman Catholic one to be bigger. Kind of like the, the M here, the logo for Mercy Side, just looks like the Monsters Inc. logo. Mike Wazowski. So quick word of advice, if you're someone that is planning on visiting Liverpool, probably best to use City Mapper. Uh, our experience with Google Maps is, mine personally, is it works really well in London, but outside of that, for public transit, not that great. Uh, so we're just passing through the, uh, the University of uh, Liverpool right now to get to a better bus stop that City Mapper told us about that actually is functioning. So, to Sefton Park. Welcome to Sefton Park. Wow, it looks like autumn's already arrived. What'd you just say? I just said I'm not impressed yet, but... I'm not I'm impressed. <laughs> I think this place looks lovely so far. We're at the beginning of the park. I it's a massive to park. I don't get for not liking Sefton Park. I'm Any Scousers, please leave your anti-Blisses hating of Sefton Park, or not impressed <laughs> by the park. It looks like autumn's already arrived. I love it. Oh, look, there's even a bench. A place to sit. 10 out of 10 park for me. Like this video if you like Liverpool. It is quite a pretty bench. You said this tree looks fake. <laughs> it tried to liven the place up a bit today. Brought in some trees. <laughs> it's a nice looking tree. The very green water. Mm, feels nice. Quite soft. It feels like um, American hardwood. We've got like the nice red there as well. It just looks like we're at a golf course and we should be able to walk like right over this. Bliss, do you want to try walking across, please? Like, that, it's so strange, that looks so still. You can see the reflections, but yet... It is so still. It's so still. Wow. It's like green ice. Can you touch it? Should I? Was someone going to get upset because I've disturbed something? No. Disturbed the ecosystem. It's a boy. Oh, that's so cute. All right, so we've made it to the Palm House, a Victorian glass house, botanical collection, Peter Pan statue, and a giant chess set. And it looks like they're hosting a wedding, so it's closed to visitors. Takeaway is open. Wow, bad timing. Well, that looks like it'd be fun. Imagine being in there, everybody. It'd be... It'd be really nice. They're having a great time in that wedding over there. And um, just, just imagine, it's nice. It spins, oh, there it goes, it's spinning around. <laughs> oh, get him. What's your review of Sefton Park? I like it. I really like it. Uncancelled. <laughs> Thank you. It reminds me of Richmond Park in a way. Like, yeah. it's very big. There's lots of different parts of it. Almost like that church we were in today. Or cathedral, if you want to be pedantic. Bird. Well, uh, I stepped in some dog poo, and uh, I thought a good way to get rid of this dog poo is to do a little dance. Uh, here's a live recreation of the act of the little Irish jig to get rid of the dog poo. Uh, and I go to then stomp on the pavement here to sit down on the bench and this girl starts laughing and so I went dog shit and then she went I love your videos 
awkward. Mostly Hill Child Care are proud to be rated good. Bliss, look behind you. Guess what they won? <laughs> <laughs> the Green Flag Award, of course. They give it to literally every park. Congrats. Put our flag up to say that you've got a flag. You are a park. <laughs> Side. We've been to the Metropolitan and we've been to Liverpool. Oh. Oh, no, we didn't go on the bus. Not yet, no. And so to end our lovely day, we're going to go to Maggie May's Cafe Bar for some Scouse, a very popular food. It's made differently all over Liverpool. Homemade Scouse served with beetroot or red cabbage and crusty bread. That's what she looks like. She's, she's quite a, a, a lovely woman. So the same thing that happened to us yesterday. <laughs> Actually, we're not going to get Scouse there because even though they're open for another full hour, they close the kitchen an hour early, and so I just don't understand why they won't just. That's the that should be the closing time. You might as well just say you're closed at five, if it's you can't actually dangerous. order anything. No, no. So I just got us a pint and a half for five seventy. So that's not bad. Can you please with that? Mm-hmm. Can you believe this? The kitchen's closed at six thirty p.m. Due to technical difficulties. <laughs> they were like, we've heard Evan's coming. There's no such and thing as hungry. food in this city. <laughs> you can't get food at a pub here. This has been three days this of trying to find great. food. It tastes we massive. It. This is called a lager in black. Uh -huh. <laughs> no, you don't like it. it That's sweet. so weird. You it's just like it. weird. I like it. Can I try yours? Carling just tastes like something, but I don't know what it is. I don't think we're ever going to get a scouse. <laughs> Tomorrow. <laughs> no scouts in the end. So many attempts in this city. I uh, just finished watching an episode of Ted Lasso. Oh, good. Had a little tear. I'm gonna s just skip forward to tomorrow. See if I can get some scouts and uh, end this one with a bang. Wow, what a fun night that was. Jesus Christ, we're actually leaving uh, three days early from this place because crazy, psycho, ridiculous, holy crap, terrifying. I, I literally was like holding a knife by the door. She was pounding on our door and screaming extremities for two straight hours, just pounding things, slamming doors, being swearing all over. Oh my God, it was terrifying. Uh, so we're heading to a hotel. Uh, so, ha, huh, I don't, uh, do we have any time for scouts, you think? No. Yeah, we have to. but we have tomorrow to we can get Scouse though, right? Yeah. So we're gonna get Scouse <laughs> tomorrow. Here's what it is. Let's just skip forward to Scouse time. Nice, looking good. We got, what is it, red cabbage? Yes. Wow, and crusty bread <laughs> and a nice stew. So Bliss, how's the Scouse? It's so good. Yeah. It's so good. You wanna describe what it is? Um, a meaty stew, I'd say. Mmm. You like it? Wow. It's so rich. And especially the combination. Wow. With the cabbage? I'm <laughs> with just the cabbage. impressed. Yeah, yeah, with the cabbage. This cabbage is very vibrant. Very vibrant. Mm hmm. And the crusty bread. You guys love using adjectives that really shouldn't be used to describe food. This bread's crusty. You guys like. <laughs> what do you mean? You wouldn't say crusty bread. <laughs> we have to describe it. You know what? I'm very impressed. It's very tasty. Good job, Liverpool. A good dish. Yum. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Well, we're going to the Blackpool Illumination soon, so be sure to subscribe to watch that video. Thank you so much for watching this one if you want. I've got another one right here you can watch. Or the, you know what? I don't even know where they are anymore. But um, thanks for staying in touch. Future Evan, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.